Welcome back to Daily Flash. It's Memorial Day, and most people will be grilling hamburgers and hot dogs, right? right? That's right. Well, we've got some ideas to dress up those hot dogs. Now, hot dog bars are becoming popular, where you can add unique ingredients beyond the mustard and relish. Okay. Now, before we get going, there are some purists out there that say you're not supposed to put anything on uh, uh, until you hit the age of 18. You can put whatever you want on a hot dog, but after the age of 18, you're not supposed to put anything but yep. mustard. Maybe some relish, pickle no relish. No ketchup. <laughs> no ketchup. So I did a little research. The this is true, and this is a true statement from okay. the National Hot Dog and Sausage Council. Oh, because that's a thing. Because it's a real thing. <laughs> it says that in a hot dog etiquette, the organization decreed that for those 18 years and older, uh, it's unacceptable to put ketchup on. You're only allowed to put mustard, oh. relish, onions, cheese, and chili on it. They say ketchup because of its acidic taste takes away from the hot dog. But wow. do you know why I put ketchup on a hot dog? Why? To take away from the taste <laughs> of the hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> the hot dog. <laughs> so we're going to have to do that today, all right, all right. All right uh, with some cool stuff. What do we got That's going right. on? right. We're going to make two different hot dogs today, actually. We're going to start with the buffalo dog, which is celery leaves, buffalo wing sauce, ranch drizzle, blue cheese, chives, and scallions. Okay. And we made some substitutions here. We're going to put some parsley on here. Now, there, these things, of course, hot dogs are the easiest way. When I grew up, we made them on the stove top. So yes, we're going to make four of them in here. Water. We're gonna take yeah, let let's the water boil. Going. So we'll make you, our first one. Give you the hot dog first Thank there. Thank you. Uh, I just you know I just prefer not to know what goes into hot dogs, <laughs> and I think the government is the same way. <laughs> so let's, I only, just, let's just not talk about it. I think right? that's, today we don't talk about it all, at all. Alrighty. So in order to make this the delicious uh, uh, the buffalo, buffalo dog, dog, we start off with some celery leaves, right? Uh, which we don't have, so we're gonna actually do some chives and some. Uh, 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 what is this? Parsley. Parsley. Yay. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna make mine here. You can put on yours. Okay. We'll kind of put this through here. I kind of like the color it adds to the hot dog. I think so but. too. And now the good taste of it's actually gonna come from things like uh, your sauces that we're gonna put on here. But uh, one thing that a lot of people are afraid to try, and that is the blue cheese. I right. am that person. <laughs> so I, I don't. I don't blame you. I took my shoes off this morning and put this. <laughs> <laughs> Put this together. I've never been more appetized now, by now, blue cheese. Now that ketchup doesn't look bad at all, does it? All right, so let's put we some put some blue cheese yeah, on it. Yeah. There we go. Me sloppily put on there, and then we got what uh, a little bit of ranch, right? All right, let's get that going. And while you put your ranch on, I'm going to put a little bit of the uh, uh, barbecue. You sauce. know, in Chicago, they go all out on their hot dude. Dogs. They put so much on it. So what, They'll like, put like, like entire pickles. <laughs> yeah, like <I> entire <laughs> pickle slices. There you go. Ooh, that's so a far, lot I do. I, I agree with you with the there colors. I think it looks uh, oh, really dog. cool. I'm gonna add a little, little bit of that. These are colorful. Yeah. This is a really nice presentation too. If you're having a party, it's a lot it's, of work to make one hot dog. But <laughs> but you're you're hiding your the guess. taste of the hot dogs, right? <laughs> And you make a little bar up for them, and look at there. There's what mine looks there you like. Go. Yours actually Cheers. looks better. Cheers to you. Oh wait, I missed the barbecue sauce. Oh, oh right, here, so. yeah. So we got to put barbecue sauce on. All right. So as you do that, I'll take a bite of mine. Yeah. Um, How is it? I don't taste the hot dog. That's just good. So not bad. Now one of our I'm last states imagine. that were became a state was Hawaii, right? Mm -hmm. Here's the Hawaiian. Sorry. <laughs> The Hawaiian dog. We're gonna start off easily with some pineapples, and you need some barbecue sauce and some diced shallot. You all grill right. the pineapples up on the grill, and you don't need to add anything to it at all. We're, just, replace, we're replacing our diced shallot with onions. There you go. Now you put that in there, and, and then you throw some of that this uh, barbecue sauce on there. Grilled pineapples. Oh, yes. Yeah. Really good. I think stuff. mine's done first. So I'm gonna give it a bite. You give it a bite. Here and right. let me see what you think of it. And then I'm gonna throw a little bit of this on here for me. As you can tell. Oh wow. You like that one? Sweet taste. The pineapple really, really makes a difference. All right, there you go. All right, mm. Memorial Day, hot dog. Now you can really not taste the hot dog at your barbecue sauce. This is good. Or barbecue uh, today. <laughs> so good luck.